Denver Broncos Mile High View. No commercials, no bullshit. The game was just as I said it had to be done. The offensive line had to bust open holes for the running backs. That's what was needed to win this game. It needed to be a will to win at the line of scrimmage. Everybody in the NFL can seem to run against Kansas City, and this is really what the Broncos had to do in this game if they were going to win this game. And the Broncos not only do not have any will, uh, they haven't got the personnel up front uh, to remotely run against a team that struggles against the run. This is going to have to be a point of emphasis at the, at the end of this season. They're going to have to bring in a lot of people. This, this whole offensive line needs to be revamped. And it's not because Larry was out. It's definitely not because Juwan James was out. Uh, again, during the past plays, what did we see all day long? Free runners coming in. Same old story, you know. You can't expect a, a rookie quarterback to come in and, and actually develop. Uh, he needed that running game more than anything. It was abandoned quickly They uh, because they couldn't run. I mean, they were sacking Freeman behind the line of scrimmage. That's how bad their run blocking is. Um, uh, it was just a horrible offensive display, defensive display. Uh, Chris Harris getting burned for a touchdown as usual. Uh, you add him up against Kelsey. I mean, you can't do better than that. Uh, although I do think the flag against him was bogus because uh, they, uh, one of the Chiefs did exactly the same thing. Of course, they w- they threw the flag but wouldn't call it. Um, some home cooking for the Chiefs there, but uh, <clears throat> the Denver Broncos have to do better than putting Adam up against with with Kelsey. Though, uh, bottom line, yeah, the Broncos do not have the player personnel right now uh, to compete. Um, to even make it a, a competition, uh, it seemed to me the Broncos went there again, uh, you know, almost at the point of urinating it down the side of their leg. Uh, there, there were just no was no will at all. Uh, the goal line stands were were were, were the defense's only redeeming quality, but um, quite frankly, I don't think that the Kansas City Chiefs were really putting all that much effort into it. To be honest with you, uh, wide open. Um, Wide open personnel, uh, just gaps all over the place. Uh, free runners at the Denver Broncos quarterback. Um, a horrible display. Uh, and these free runners at the quarterback is beginning to be a Scandrello, uh like trademark with this offense. Uh, defensively for the Broncos, the Broncos once again look confused, uh, unprepared. Um, it just was pretty bad. It was just a very poor display. They made it rather easy on uh, Mahomes. I mean, for the most part, he wasn't really pressured that much, uh, uh, really. Um, kind of came a little later. So I think that uh, defensive line help is is obviously going to be a uh, – Kind of a priority offensive line help, I think. It is really going to be the emphasis this offseason. And I'm not going to really be satisfied if they don't, because they're not going to help lock out if they don't get this offensive line upgraded. It's just, it's, it really hasn't really changed much since uh, Trevor Simeon was, uh, you know, hiking the ball. So the offensive line just hasn't been given any attention, the attention it really needs. Uh, you can't bring bring in Juwan James. The, these these type of guys just aren't going to cut it. Uh, they're going to have to bring in a lot more, you know, free agent help. Uh, they're going to have to get some help in the draft. Uh, they really are going to have to look like a completely different offensive line by uh, the start of next year. Uh, they're going to have to start willing, you know, putting their enforcing their will on the people like the Chiefs. You know, if, if the Broncos are busting open big run plays, that completely changes that game. That game changes completely. They just don't have the personnel to do it. So uh, just another crappy uh, effort by the Denver Broncos. Uh, lack of player personnel in the trenches. Uh, what else can you say?